The solar eclipse is officially on its way, and I live somewhere very, very special. The path of totality. Which is essentially the moon's shadow passing over the earth as it blocks the sun. But while everybody's worried about the moon and the sun, I'm going to be capitalizing on one thing. Food. You see, in honor of this being a once in a lifetime event, there's actually a bunch of restaurants offering both discounts and extremely limited menu items. So for the next 23 hours and 57 minutes, I have one goal. Find as many solar specials as humanly possible before the moment of totality. I better, I better get a move on. First up, chilies. Are y'all running any like specials for the solar eclipse? You can get a free appetizer with an adult entree. And just like that, the boys and I were already saving money. But we had to make haste because the clock was ticking and there were countless solar specials to be had. And of course, we're gonna rank these solar specials the only way we know how, a tier list. So I hate to say it, but Chili's is D tier. If the three for 10 is better than your solar special, what are you doing? I know it may seem like a harsh rating, but here's what the boys and I are looking for. One, taste. Two, money saved. And three, galactic pizzazz. AKA, it should pay homage to the solar eclipse in some form or fashion. Luckily, the closer we get to the moment of totality, the crazier some of these solar specials are gonna get. How's it going? <laughs> My friend and I were making a video where we're trying to try as many different solar eclipse specials as possible. Do y'all have like a special solar eclipse smoothie or anything? And to my surprise, not only did they have a special smoothie, but they also passed out these. Mmm, that's actually quite good. It tastes like those uh, go-gurts you would use to get. Those are fire. Smoothie King Solar Special, B tier. The glasses conquest has started. How many can we collect? <laughs> Hi, um... I was just wondering if y'all have any special like solar eclipse menu items or deals going on? Uh, for an eclipse? Yeah. Uh, no, we don't have any special for that. Oh, okay. All good. As you can see, not every restaurant is running a deal. So for each one who fails to deliver, we have a very special place reserved. F tier. I was just wondering, do y'all have any like special solar eclipse menu items or deals going on? We will tomorrow. Not until Monday. Not until Monday, okay. So it turns out we might have started this challenge a bit too early, but time is ticking and the traffic is only going to get worse. So if we're going to find 24 solar specials, we're going to need all 24 hours to do so. Luckily, our homie at Starbucks actually ended up hooking us up. Thank you so much. Y'all have a great day. Yep. Thank you. Dude, that looks that is, insane. That is giving solar eclipse vibes. Essentially, the drink was a vanilla bean frap with a shot of espresso on top. But I'll be the first to say, I'm just not a huge coffee guy. Oh, that is strong. <laughs> Holy cow. You know what else is strong? Solar clips. <laughs> Starbucks, B tier. Next up, Baskin Robbins. See if they have a deal. How's it going? Do y'all have any like special flavors for the solar eclipse or anything like that? No special deals. Baskin Robbins, F tier. However, word on the street was the next place was supposed to have a pretty legit solar special. Hi, um, I was wondering, do y'all have any special solar eclipse menu items or deals? Any what? Solar Eclipse menu items? No, sir. No special menu items? No, sir. I thought y'all had some sort of like a uh, blackout slush shake or something. What is it called? It'll be gone like next week. It'll be gone next week, you said? Yeah, they just bought it for the Eclipse. Okay, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll take one of those. Appreciate it. Oh, we got some glasses. This will make a fine addition to my collection. <laughs> the glasses were for sure cool, but we still had to try this mysterious blackout slush float. That looks like a good bite right there. Yeah. One bite, everybody knows the rules. What the heck is that flavor? Well, according to the internet, it's a mix between dragon fruit and cotton candy, which definitely would not be my first choice for flavor combos, but man, was it delicious. This is good. Sonic S tier. Super elite, like, look at this. Just looks insane also tastes great. However, just because Sonic made it to S tier doesn't necessarily mean they're the top dog. Because at the end of this video, during the moment of totality, the boys and I will pick one S tier to crown out of this world. Next up, Krispy Kreme. We're back. <laughs> Check out the Shack vid if you uh, want to know more. I want to wear the glasses, but I'm also embarrassed to wear the glasses. <laughs> How's it going? Uh, do y'all have any like special solar eclipse donuts or deals or anything? Can I just do one of those? Just one of them? Yeah. Do you have plans to watch the solar eclipse tomorrow? <laughs> I guess so. Everybody's been talking about it. They're, I guess I'm gonna... they're saying it's a once in a lifetime event. <laughs> once in a lifetime event, so I guess I'm gonna have to. Turns out Krispy Kreme has a specialty donut, and I honestly think they nailed the design of it. Wow, that is insane. <laughs> That's actually really good. Krispy Kreme, S tier. <laughs> Krispy Kreme, Krispy Kreme, S tier. Yes, sir. <laughs> Tiff's treats. See if they got any solar specials. 
It smells amazing in here. <laughs> yeah, uh, we we're just wondering if y'all had any like special solar eclipse cookies. Long story short, they had a special, but it was essentially just a lemon cookie paired with a chocolate cookie. That's strange. That's not it, Chief. Tiff's treats, D tier. At this point, we had essentially spent the whole afternoon only to find six solar specials, three Eclipse glasses, and a small savings of $5.99. So sadly, I had to drop Josh off for the day so he could be with his wife. Okay, see you tomorrow for the Eclipse. Eclipse boys! But for me, the day wasn't over just yet. Word on the street is Jenny's has new ice cream flavors for the solar Eclipse. Let's find out if that's true. How's it going? Um, are these y'all's new flavors for the... And to my surprise, they didn't just have one, but four new flavors. So being the ice cream enthusiast I am, I bought all of them to properly conduct the taste test. I've never tried Jenny's on camera. I have tried them once before, but I'm gonna rate the Solar Special, and I'm also just gonna rate the ice cream shop in general. If you like blackberries, that flavor is insane. It's almost like a blackberry, blueberry, raspberry something. I was a bit disappointed that each of the flavors were fruit based, but I will say I did enjoy them more than I expected. As far as solar specials go, this might be S tier. Four unique ice cream flavors just for the solar eclipse. Kind of insane. Overall, I think Jenny's is like an 8.2. I forgot to mention, but Jenny's also passed out solar eclipse glasses as well. So we're up to four different solar eclipse glasses. I'd say Jenny's definitely went all out for the eclipse. So I'm gonna put them in S tier. I think that's the last solar special we can do the day before the solar eclipse. So let's just jump cut to the next morning, shall we? Ladies and gentlemen, today's the day. April 8th, 2024. The solar eclipse is happening in T minus six hours and like 10-ish minutes. I am currently standing at a Cracker Barrel with one thing on my mind, pancakes. This is kind of a random question. Are y'all selling any like special solar eclipse menu items or deals? Today, if you mention the eclipse pancakes, you get an order of free pancakes with your breakfast. That sounds amazing to me. <laughs> so I was quickly seated and before I could say the word solar special, I was looking at an absolute mother load of a breakfast. And let me just say, it did not disappoint. I gotta save room for the rest of the solar specials, but honestly, this was delicious. Ah. Got a new pair of solar eclipse glasses. Honestly, Cracker Barrel, A tier. I don't know if that's just because I'm starving and that was maybe one of the best breakfasts I've had in a long time, but uh, the service was amazing, the pancakes were delicious, and honestly, Cracker Barrel, I mean, the restaurant was empty, but all around, I think Cracker Barrel's kind of being slept on. Also, look, these classes are like, scream America, which I love. <laughs> And in case you're wondering, I have not abandoned Josh. He was just really set on getting his own solar special breakfast. I don't know what he has up his sleeve, but let's just plan on meeting him later. Hi, um, I was just wondering if y'all are running any special deals for the solar eclipse. Oh, no. No special deals? No. Okay. No problem. Have a good day. Okay, bye-bye. The sad thing is I know Wendy's is supposed to be doing like a free frosty, but I don't know. Maybe it's only at participating locations. Wendy's F tier. I was just wondering if y'all have any special menu items or deals happening for the solar eclipse today. I'm gonna be honest, I have no idea what deal we just got, but um, we got something. Thank you, have a blessed day. Mickey D's delivered us the bag. We got a hash brown and a sausage biscuit for $2.50. After doing a little math, the total savings was $1.18. Which definitely isn't much, but how would it taste? Bro, why does McDonald's just always hit? It's like the opposite of Burger King. McDonald's, C tier. Not huge savings, not huge creativity, but uh, I think our homie in the drive-thru came in clutch for us. On to the next restaurant in the path of totality. I was just wondering if y'all have any like special menu items or deals for the solar eclipse? We are not. <laughs> Unfortunately, no. Uh, no, we have the regular menu. Man, this might be the first time ever Chick-fil-A is going in F tier. You hate to see it. You really do hate to see it. That string of F tiers was pretty tough. Luckily, I knew one place was for sure offering a deal. Jack in the box. Hi, um, I just have a mobile order pickup for Cohen. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. Yep, you too. Essentially, the deal was a buy one, get one using their mobile app. However, I didn't even want one of these burgers, much less two. I'm not gonna lie, that's not great. Why would you sell a burger without cheese? Just tell me that. Why would you sell a burger without cheese? Jack in the box, D tier. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Jack in the Box might have been a fail, but we got three hours and 30 minutes until the solar eclipse happens, and we got more solar specials to get to, so we got to hustle. I wonder how Josh is doing. Secured the Marcos deal. 
50% off. Look at that. Oh, baby. Solar Eclipse, I will be prepared for you because of this pizza. So while Josh was finishing up his pizza for breakfast, I decided to make a few more stops. Canes looks like they got something going on. It looks like Canes, if you enter online, you have the chance to win free Canes for 20 years. And not only that, but they also offered a free toast with the purchase of a box combo. Yep, you too. Look at this, baby. Our free toast right there. It's beautiful. Here's the taste test. The toast deal isn't very, like it's not a very good deal, but included in this solar special is the chance at 20 years of free canes. So just because of that, I think we gotta put a nest here. Hopefully Josh is just about done at Marco's. Howdy, um, I was here yesterday and the lady working mentioned something about there being a special deal for the solar eclipse today. The, uh, small original or the small red veggie for $2.99. That's a $4 savings right there. It's a good deal, but it's not the craziest solar special we've seen all day. So uh, I think I'm going to see here. By now, surely Josh has finished that Marco's pizza. How was the Marco's, Jay Millie? Fire, as always. What tier did you put it in? A tier. The solar eclipse countdown is down to an hour 50 minutes. Ooh. So and we want to make sure we're in time to get into position and stuff so we gotta hustle if we're gonna hit our goal of finding 24 solar specials in 24 hours luckily there is a few online deals for us to take advantage of Divin dots offering a 25 percent off any order c tier new flavor from perfect bar plus a whopping 50 percent off if you're in the path of totality b tier moon pie offered a new flavor plus glasses which i received a few days later hmm that's not bad b tier and finally sun chips limited edition solar eclipse chips that you could only buy within the four minutes and 23 seconds of the solar eclipse happening. Which means I'm gonna be in a bit of a time crunch during the moment of totality. But I can't think too hard about that right now because there's not much time and there's some pretty legendary solar specials yet to be had. For example, Pizza Hut. This pizza chain is offering any large pizza for $12. This includes any create your own pies, up to 10 toppings. Seems like a good deal. Are y'all running the solar eclipse special? $12.99? Yeah. Yes. So we can do up to 10 toppings? Bad news. We did not get 10 toppings. Essentially, they only let us do six toppings, so either the advertisement was fake or this location just didn't offer the full deal, but we still ended up with a $12 meat lovers. Yeah, I'm taking a bite. Honestly, it tastes pretty good. Pizza, A tier. Would've been S tier if they allowed us to put all 10 toppings on. That would've been elite. We then went on to Burger King where we got scammed by a fake deal. I hate Burger King. The grand opening of a Cosmics, which threw this huge party for the eclipse. <laughs> and walked by Insomnia, which allegedly had a specialty cookie. Insomnia cookie has a deal, but we gotta catch the solar eclipse. Priorities. There's not enough time. So maybe we didn't hit our goal of 24 solar specials, but there was still one thing we had left to do. And even though the food was good, I came to realize one thing. There's really only one special that deserves to be classified as out of this world. Dude, look at it! Look at it! Without it! What? Oh! No, it's worth! It's worth! Oh. It's worth! It's so dark. It's so dark. <laughs> this is crazy. This is insane. Oh my gosh. One like, and we'll do this again at the next solar eclipse. <laughs> this is crazy. Peace out.